Welcome back and thanks for watching. This is Katahdin Cooking Mama and I'm doing a menu plan. I'm on keto, but my family members are not. But I'm going to do a menu plan. You can follow along with me. You can make your own. I'm shopping my pantry and just getting a few things that I need to get. Okay, so one of the things I want to do is a keto bacon breakfast. Um, so I'm going to put that on Tuesday. Okay, then I'm going to do um, a breakfast bite. So I'm going to skip right here, keto breakfast bite. And then we're going to be like egg, cheese, whatever vegetables I have. And they're going to be put in muffin tins. And I'll be able to freeze these. So these are breakfast bites. Sunday, I'm not going to be home. So I'm just going to cross out Sunday. Because we will be visiting with family. And it might be a cheat day for me. I'm going to hope to stay on it. But you know. You got to go with what you got. So um, yeah. So tomorrow I'm going to do. Um, nacho chicken casserole. That's going to be for supper. So that's going to be made with hamburger, which I have, um, some tomato, which I have. Um, you're just going to make a nacho bake, and I will have the recipe, and I'll post the recipe later. I don't usually do lunch. The family grabs leftovers. And for breakfast, I'm going to do um, bagels and cream cheese. I have keto bagels. And the family will have oatmeal. So I'm going to skip breakfast all the way down here because I'm doing intermittent fasting. And if I don't eat breakfast on one of these days, I will grab something in between here. But I'm going to make a breakfast plan, but that doesn't mean I might stick with it. Okay, so I'm going to cross off the nacho ch chicken. I'm also going to cross off the keto breakfast. These were some ideas I wanted to do. And the breakfast bites. Okay, then one day I want to make um, Keto Capri's Salad. And that's going to be an easy day because you just take mozzarella, tomato, um, basil, and balsamic. And I would give them something else. Because they have a lot of pasta in the house. I can cook it up ahead of time. So that would be awesome. And, um, okay, um, because I have hamburger here, actually, yeah, hamburger here, so I'm going to put hamburger meat, and I have it, and the Capri salad, I'm going to need basil, because I don't have anything grown, I've got tomato, and, um, mozzarella, because you need the hard mozzarella. So these two things I have to shop for. So on Wednesday, I'm just going to skip breakfast. And Friday, I'm going to skip breakfast. Okay. So I'm going to do a chicken dish. So I'm going to do the fried chicken because we did not have it. And I'm going to make it with almond flour. And I'm going to I'm going to fry it in the oven. So I'm going to do um, cabbage because I have leftover cabbage. And I'm also going to do a salad that night because I need a second vegetable. Okay. So I'm going to cross that off my list. And before it gets to be um, the weekend, I want to do a keto flourless brownie so I'm gonna put it here I'm gonna to try to get that done and I'm also going to cook up some eggs tomorrow uh, tomorrow's gonna to be my busy day maybe Tuesday one dozen of eggs and I'm also gonna make my breads which is gonna be the cloud bread 
I'm going to try to make that. And let's see here. Um, so I got to cross this off here. Keto low carb, sweet and sour chicken. Well, we're having chicken there. So, um, Big Mac salad. Because we had salad, we're going to have a salad here. Let's skip a couple days. Let's do a salad here. Big Mac salad. That was really, really delicious. That was really, it tasted like I was eating a Big Mac. Honest to God, guys, it was so good. Okay. So Sunday we're going to have crossed off. Maybe we'll, we will get something. I don't know. Um, Saturday I'm going to try the pot of beans. So I'm going to put beans on in the morning. So I'm going to start them on Friday night. I'm going to soak them. And I'm going to start them Saturday morning. You know, I am strictly keto. But I can count that carb for my food. And my daughter has um, chili. And she's on keto. So I'm going to make a pot of beans. I'm going to do a pot of pinto beans. And I'm going to do them in the pressure cooker. So we are going to have beans this night. And I'll probably do a sausage. Because there's some really good flavorful sausages out there. There's chicken and kale that I just had recently that was awesome. And uh, yeah. So let's see. We've got one meal. And I don't want it to be chicken. Because i got chicken here. And I'm going to have fried chicken here. No, I got nacho cheese here, so that's hamburger. Then a salad, then chicken, then a Big Mac. So this hamburger, hamburger. So yeah, we will. We'll do the sour chicken. Sweet and sour chicken. And I'm going to do a keto ver version. So what do I need to do? I need to make my cloud bread. So that's one thing I need to do. I have to... I'm going to try to do my breakfast bites in advance. I need to do the beans. So that's the second thing I got to do. I have to shop for these two items. So I'm going to X right there. Um, I have hamburger meat. So hamburger's covered. I have some lettuce. Lettuce is covered. I got Thousand Island dressing covered. Tomato covered and pickle covered. So this is covered. The beans and sausage, I have to get sausage. So that has to be shopping. The sour chicken, I'm going to look to see if I have any chicken. If not, I might have to shop for that as well as this. I have this. And I have this. Okay. Now the bacon breakfast. I need to get some bacon. The bagels with cream cheese. We got that covered. So um, breakfast bites. I have eggs. I'm going to pick up another dozen of eggs. And I'm going to get them at the Dollar Tree. Or if I go out and do Ibotta. Because I'm going to try to start doing some of my rebates. So anyways, this is my breakfast idea. I'm going to cross this off. And that. And that. So these are all new recipes I'm going to try. This is my menu. So Monday, tomorrow, we're going to have bagels with cream cheese. I already have them made. So all i got to do is put cream cheese on it. Have my coffee. I'm going to do... Um, I'm going to put um, MCT oil in my coffee. And I'm going to just use the sweetener, which is a sugar-free sweetener. I'm going to do nacho uh, chicken casserole. I'll be on the road, so I'm going to do intermittent fasting. So th this has to go six hours for intermittent fasting. So if I have my breakfast when I get up, then by the time I eat supper, that's my internet, intermittent fasting. And the same here. The bacon breakfast, um, that is going to be a, on a bagel. And I have them made. Um, I'm going to make some homemade cloud bread. Keto Capri salad. I haven't done that and uh, it sounds delicious. So I'm going to make that. I'm going to make them spaghetti. Because I have lots of pasta in the house and I want to use up the carbs that we have here. 
So I'm going to make some fried chicken. I'm going to make it with almond flour, some seasonings like paprika, salt, pepper, garlic, pepper, onion, pepper. I'm going to put it in a bag, shake the chicken, put it in the oven with olive oil. And I'm going to serve it with cabbage and a side of salad. Okay, I'm going to skip breakfast here and I'm going to do it all the way to here. Uh, the breakfast bites is um, egg, some uh, cheese, and I have several bags of cheese now. And um, I'm going to need eggs and put vegetables in there and your meat. I'm going to have bacon or ham in that. And then I'm going to skip lunch. I'm going to do sour chicken, keto version. And um, I'm going to skip breakfast. They're going to have oatmeal and yogurt because that's what I have. And I'm going to make some homemade keto flourless brownies. I'm also going to do a keto fudge. I'm going to have two sweets this week. So I'm going to prepare one sweet here and one sweet here. So I have two and I'm going to make my bread and I'm also going to get my beans ready the night before so they can soak and put them in for Saturday. And we're going to do it with sausages because there's a whole mess of different types out. The Big Mac salad is lettuce in a bowl. Then you cook up your ground beef. Um, I did patties and I covered them with cheese, with cheddar cheese, and then I cut them all up and sliced them on that. And then I put pickles, um, onions, tomato, and um, Thousand Island. It was so good. So beans, sausage, Sunday will be gone. And I took care of the meals. So I hope you guys enjoy this. And I hope you give me a thumbs up. Please like and share. And I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.